Good. So just diagram all the way up to while. OK, let's, let's, uh, Ben's gotten to a point where he must ask himself a question. So let's ask that as an entire class. Is Pixie Fairies a compound noun? In other words, that's two nouns placed together, like student athlete. That would be a compound noun, two nouns placed together. Or is it a noun with a modifying adjective? Pix is Pixie an adjective or is Pixie a noun? Pixie's a noun. Pixie-ish pixie -ish is an adjective. And I know you're saying pixie-ish, really? Yeah, I've actually heard that word several times. So what you should do, Ben, hold on, is diagram pixie fairies as one unit. It's a compound noun. So place it together. Don't separate pixies and fairies. Mm -hmm. Nice. Put the pen down just for a moment. When last we met about talking about sentence diagramming, I was disturbed in not only one class but multiple classes about how many students just kind of dropped the predicate adjective, predicate nominative, direct object, indirect object concept. So I'm glad to see that Ben has not dropped this concept. Um, Ethan. What is Pixie Fairies here? He's placed a straight horizontal line next to caught. What is Pixie Fairies? What grammar structure is it? How's that for putting you on the spot? Me, Mr. Clarkson, saying we've been very disappointed <coughs> in the students. Ethan, answer the question. OK, yes. Taylor, help him out. It's a direct object. Why, Taylor? True, that's one answer to the question. But also answer the question by looking at caught. What type of verb is caught? Nice, action verb. OK, I've given Ben a little bit more space. So Ben, why don't you go ahead and uh, try the of surprising value. Wow. How big do you think the word of is? <laughs> Thank you, Ben. Have a seat. OK. You, so, uh, uh, Susan? Come on, Susan. If you're going to correct, correct. Oh, OK, fine. Mr. Clarkson, you old card you. I'll get up there. No, it would be com it would be compound. Mister is not uh, not your adjective. Sorry. <laughs> Susan, would you mind explaining what you've just done and how how you fixed Ben's diagram? Very good. So surprising is an adjective describing value. Therefore, it must fall below on the diagonal. She's correct. What has Ben done correctly? <laughs> I'm sorry, Smirny? Attached to? Very good. What I was looking for you guys to say or notice is that he has placed it here on this side of the, hor or the vertical line indicating that of surprising value is modifying pixie fairies. Which pixie fairies? The pixie fairies of surprising value, not those cheap ones that just anybody can have. I'm sorry? 
okay?